Hello, people of YouTube. Oh, no. Hello, people of YouTube. It is I, four-time four Junior Ranger at four different parks, all national, and the nation is Wisconsin. I had to re-pierce my ear today. It, like, was, I didn't have any earrings in here for, like, months, and then I put an earring in, like, a week ago, and I was like, oh, you want to use this piercing? Never mind, and it closed up, so I had to re-pierce it today. But that's not the point of this video. Um, the point of this video is ceramics. I took a ceramics class and I'm not ashamed to say I got a BC on it. That's my first BC ever. I kind of feel like Jesus. But I thought it would be fun to test out some of my mugs, some of my things, because I have lots of lots. My room looks like a tomb. It's full of just all these pots and stuff that I don't know what to do with. That's literally the video, so I'll be rating them too, I think. Did I not mention that? Well, now you know. So, a lot of these are, excuse me, I'm literally kneeling right now. Like, this is a horrible YouTube setup. The test, hold on, I feel like it'll look better if we just have things. I shall be testing these with the ever popular, at least in my room, Arizona tea. I get the diet tea because better. So that's why I get it. Here's a, sand, a demonstration. This is one of my least favorite ones. So I'll demonstrate with this one what we're going to be doing today. Yeah, I'd give this a solid like three out of 10 because one, it's not a lot of space to drink liquid. That's where you would keep it. And the lip, I don't know if you can see, it's just very, it's very thick. It's very thick to like put your mouth, like what am I, huh? Next up, okay, so that was a little demonstration. Now we're gonna be a little more professional about this, I would hope. Now this is a bowl. I'm not really sure how to test a bowl. So, I'm also just gonna drink from it. Cause why not? I don't know. Okay, I don't know if you can see this. Hopefully you can. This is carved a lot, like a lot. And I put a little frog right there, a little froggy. That's his eye, that's his other eye. And they're like, I don't know what's wrong with the glaze, but do you see that milky? It looks like, naughty. <laughs> it looks naughty. I don't know what you can say on YouTube, so it'll be a learning experience. Wait, I can say anything, because that's not like I'm making money off of these, right? As long as I just don't like kill a person on camera. Which, by the way, I was thinking about it, and I made, I'd talk about this. If I had a twin... I'd kill them. <laughs> no, 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 I don't mean, I don't mean like, no, but... I have such an intense urge to be an individual and different from other people that if I had an identical twin, I couldn't cope. I wouldn't know how to act and I would just not feel real. Anyways, next up. I'm not gonna, I will drink from this just a little bit. This isn't, I didn't make this. I did glaze it and I did fire it, but I didn't make it. I don't know if this was supposed to be a cup or whatnot. Uh, the glaze, I didn't do a great job. It went on, the glaze went on really thick. And I was so worried it was gonna drip down and like it stuck to the kiln. I, I, I remember I scraped the entire bottom off and it, it still dripped down really far, but just not equally because it was such a, it was, it, it was ruined the moment I dunked it. I was just like, it's over. But that's fine because I didn't make it. So no attachment. Next up, I should rate it. Well, no, it's not mine. Fuck off. This is a good one. I think this one, ironically, is not food safe, despite it's supposed to be a watermelon. I'm still gonna drink from it. This is a more of a cup size, truly. I can feel confident saying that. So here we are. I'm not gonna put a lot in there, because obviously it really only takes a sip or two. I'm not some wine taste tester pretending that grapes taste different. They are, they're grapes. Okay, and this is watermelon. Mm. 
Okay, see, now this one, I think it's leaking. I think it's, uh, I think it's leaking. So, points off for, <laughs> for not doing the one thing it's supposed to do, which is hold a liquid. But it does its best. And ultimately, so we're gonna give what we're, we're gonna give this. This cup earns a five out of ten, and I'm giving it the score because the, it had so much potential going for it. Even the outside, they don't really match very well, but the outside it ha is a lot. The inside could be a beautiful, but it just you put it, it when it all supposed to come together, it falls apart. Crazy. Okay, next up. I never drank from the bowl. Let's do that. I'll edit it so people will think that. I won't edit it. Um, so I guess the first thing we're gonna test is if it can hold a liquid, which, yeah. Great. Now, a sip. Obviously, with a lip like this, it's not gonna be pleasant and it might not even function, but here we go. surprisingly it worked better than I was expecting I'll say that but it's also a bowl it's weird it's weird but it, it kind of feels natural to hold I'm ruining it next up I'm not sure if I want to drink from this one here it, it had so much potential as well but uh the eye got messed up it dried out and we had to like work on these project at, uh, projects at home for a little bit. That's when a lot of mine went to shit because I couldn't figure out how to work on clay from home. So, uh. it's okay, we have beautiful, well, mouth, a gaping mouth. Blah. And it had these rings on the inside so it was supposed to look more like a throat. And then the handle is a tongue. I don't know if you can tell that. It was cute, and you can drink from it. So that's what we're gonna do. Step one, can it hold liquid? Yes, it can. That's good, points for that. Um, okay, I'm getting some me metallic taste in there. I think it's probably because I did a horrible job glazing this. I don't know what happened. These, this whole year has been a blur. If you ask me to, to talk about one specific memory I have, there's none. Next up, this bowl. This bowl also looks like it wasn't completely glazed. Also probably my bad. I don't know. I'm not showing you guys it. I kind of like it. It's, it's strange, yeah. And it's not really a bowl, but keep in mind, the bowls that I made, that was one of our first assignments. I couldn't use the wheel. So, I mean, that hasn't changed, but. <laughs> okay, hold the fuck up. There's fish food in here. <laughs> um, gonna take a point off for that. But, it's holding the liquid. It's holding the liquid, so. That's the job, right? You could have a little bit of cereal. Cereal. Do you remember the Q-Tips girl from Zoe one on one, on one on one? Fight me. Isn't she like Britney Spears' cousin or something? I don't know. Let's drink. I don't like it. I don't like it. Partially because this drink just ran down the side. And also because, no. So that's my thoughts on that. This is a good one. A mug. This is my tree mug. The handle, a little fancy, fancy. And it does function. I feel like, <laughs> it functions for like children who have tiny hands. It's one of my favorite pieces. And it was so easy, I literally just carved. 
Made a little handle. Boom, done. Easy. I forgot to be in the frame. You, making YouTube videos is ridiculous, but it's fine. We have to get through the garbage, which is this, before I can like learn how to edit videos and things. So, welcome to the journey. Let's begin. Okay, it doesn't seem to be leaking. Great, wonderful. And a pro about this one, the lip is actually pretty thin. So it might function as a cup. And these aren't things a lot of people think about. There's so much to making plates. It's like, why even bother? Why? I'm gonna give this one a six out of 10. I don't know if I've been rating, whatever. I like this one because it's funky. Approval. Next up, this is my final project. It blew up. I, this hole in the neck, I thought it went all the way to the center where this hollow hole was of air, this pocket of air. It did not. It was supposed to be a bird. This is a real skull, by the way. I'm like a bird, I'm a fly away. This whole beak moves and everything. But uh, yeah, things didn't go as well. So I glued it together. There's for some, slap some shells on there. And now we're gonna drink from it. Just kidding. We'll keep going. So this is a plate I made. I did make a second one, but I couldn't find it. It's pretty small. Um, this, I made this the fir first week. I was trying to make a bowl and I made a plate. <laughs> so I kept it, it was a plate. Now we're gonna drink from it. Okay. So cons, can't hold a lot of liquid, right? This is like a saucer. Um, cons. Not really a handle. I really... Oh, I just spilled. I'm gonna drink from this. Pros. It's pretty. So, for that reason alone, it, it passes. I don't know what score you need to pass, but it passes. This, at least. Next up. This is a turtle. I really regret this color choice, but what you live and you learn, right? Here we go. So, it doesn't hold a lot, but how's it, how's, the, the grip is fine. I don't have any problems with holding this, but let's drink now. Yeah, it's just, it can't hold enough. It's not really worth, uh, it's not really worth using, honestly. You're better off just taking your hand and So for that, it doesn't pass. But it is a turtle. Here's a good one. Now my ceramics teacher said this handle was a little pointy, which I would agree. I could have smoothed it out a little bit more, but I wanted to make this a strawberry. Unfortunately, there wasn't a lot of red glaze. I know you might have seen red glaze in that watermelon, but that was under glaze, and I didn't want to use under glaze because uh, this is also under glaze. It's just, it's a really risky thing. Glaze is just like art, but it's a surprise. Something I like about this one is when I put the glaze in, I poured some glaze in, and then I just like poured it out of the cup. So you can kind of see, uh, you know, like what I'm talking about. We're gonna drink from it. Okay, there's like dirt in here, whatever. It's a strawberry. There's dirt on strawberries, it's natural. Here we go. Yeah, I'd say this is a solid mug, no complaints really. Uh, even the handle, despite its sharpness, bearable, hardly even noticeable, especially if you don't grasp the top, if you hold it like this. It's a mug. Why is this so dusty? This is a bowl. Doesn't this look like thousands of years old? This is the only one I gave a foot ring. I didn't know how to do it. I destroyed a lot of pieces trying to carve like foots, feet, whatever. The edge is pretty thin. It's a pretty, it's a pretty well made bowl. Not really sure what you'd use it for, but we're gonna drink out of it. So the legs of this are a bit weak. That's what wine people say. 
And yeah, I'm not a huge fan of this. The shape really doesn't prevent spills. You, I like I like to see like open up, like get taller, wider as you get taller. Uh, or conversely, inversely rather, uh, less wide as you go up, like a little flask. What is uh, not flask? Bong. Here's a juicer. I've already juiced things on this and it works. I don't need to prove that to you. So out of laziness, we're gonna test drinking from it. Ooh, um, there's dirt in this one too. Okay. You can taste a grit. There's a, uh, there's a lot of dirt in there. Been keeping it around. Uh, some potted plants that are all dead. And also the handle sucks. Who is this for? No. I love it. I love the colors. I hate this. I hate that. I, that's why I hate ceramics. Fuck clay. Fuck clay. And yeah, that was pretty much it. I know it wasn't exactly super interesting, but a lot of us don't have anything better to do. I mean, I didn't have anything better to do than make this video. So thanks for watching, I guess. I appreciate that. I appreciate your interest in watching me drink green tea out of various ceramic pieces. For more, there, I'm never gonna make another video like this, but <laughs> yeah, okay, bye.